welcome to Durrell Wildlife Conservation Trust. We are here because the Guardian said to me, what would you most like to do in the world that you've never done before? And I thought, well, actually, what I would really, really love to do is hang out with orangutans and hang out with gorillas. And there's also another reason. At school, my nickname was Galon. Galon as in Planet of the Apes. I was a bit offended about that at the time, I thought it was a bit rude, but over time I kind of grew to love it. I grew to embrace my inner gorilla. And so here I am today, uh, basically doing a shift, feeding the gorillas. So we're in the kitchen now. Will, what's the marmite on the boxes about? What we're going to do is we're going to spread it on the inside of the boxes, some of these bags here, and it's a smell thing for them. They also like eating it. And then we're going to put some oats and porridge on the top so it will stick to the marmite. So they'll lick the oats off and then they'll take the marmite out as well. For those of you watching at home, I know you might not think this is a sound advice, but you should try it. Forget the hovis, forget the nice little, you know, slices of white bread. Just get yourself a box. Lovely. Sticking nicely to the marmite. Few berries on that would be nice. What's the best thing about um, gorillas? The way they live their life is something that I think we can learn a lot from. You know, they live in the harems, so basically it's like a very close-knit family. It's all based on sort of respect, and as long as everyone knows their place, then uh, they're, they're happy, you know. If we had their diet, we'd kind of be supermen, wouldn't we? Yeah, we're uh, very healthy. It's yeah, I mean, it's so great. It, bit of sal- can I? Sorry, yeah. Bodonga. Yeah, bit of celery. Right? He might have to take that out now, but... What, he won't eat it now? Well, he, he would, but we'd be trying not to pass on anything of like things. We've got more celery, Sorry. so... Bit of broccoli, which won't touch, because he'll get annoyed with me. What's that? Cor- it's not coriander, is it? That celery... Got a bit of leek. Yeah, leek. So it's basically potato and leek soup without the potatoes. Yeah. So we've, we've just come to give the gorillas a morning treat really, isn't it? Yeah, well, yeah, well, we call it like a, an enrichment feed. So Hello, just... darlings. And where's Badongo from? He's from uh, France. <laughs> so he was born in captivity yeah, he in was... France. Yeah. And where were his parents from? Ooh, that's a good question. <laughs> I don't know if we should... He gets really sensitive any time I mention his parents. I'm sorry, Badonga, I won't mention the parents again. Yeah, I know, it's, it's, or is it the grandparents? I think it's the grandparents that he was particularly sensitive about. 